Hello everyone, in this video I will be explaining the poem Florence Nightingale written by Emma Lazarus. Florence Nightingale This poem was written by Emma Lazarus. This poem is a tribute to Florence Nightingale who born on May 12, 1820 and worked as nurse in Barack Hospital at Scuttery during Crimean War 1854. Poem Upon the whitewashed walls, a woman's shadow falls. A woman walketh over the darksome floors, a soft angelic smile lighteth her face the white in passing through the dismal corridors. And now and then there slips a word from out her lips, more sweet and grateful to those listening ears, than the most plaintive tale of the sad nightingale whose name and tenderness this woman bears. Her presence in the room of agony and gloom no fretful murmurs, no coarse words profane. For while she standeth there, all words are hushed to say prayer. She seems God's angel weeping over man's pain. No monument of stone needs this heroic one. Her name is graven on each noble heart. And in all after years, her prize will be the tears, which at that name from quivering lids will start. Explanation of First stanza. On the beautifully painted walls, there was the shadow of a woman. The woman is no one else. That is Florence Nightingale. When she walked over the poorly lit floors, she has a very soft smile, such as an angel. Explanation of second stanza The poet describes her that she used to speak rarely, so when she speaks, it would be very pleasant and grateful to the listeners, such as patients. The poet compares her to the nightingale, which sings sad songs, but this woman is not like that. She bears the name and the tenderness of the bird alone. Explanation of third stanza Her presence in the room of pain and sad, there will be no offensive words. There will be the prayers of God to save. She seems like a God's angel as she cries for others' pain. Explanation of Last Stanza The poet says, No monument stone is needed for her selfless service, as she is graven in everyone's noble heart for her service. The only way we can praise her is by the tears when we hear her name. Thank you.